Kate Silverton, 52, has opened up about her struggle with IVF and her decision to prioritize her stressful career over having a family. The former BBC News at One presenter spoke about how she wanted to conceive naturally whilst juggling her job. Kate struggled in her personal life due to her demanding job as a newsreader where stress became a contributing factor. The former journalist made the unexpected decision to leave her broadcasting career as she addressed the error she made during her pregnancy journey in a new interview. She told OK! Magazine, when we respond to stressors, such as work or difficult family circumstances, adrenaline and cortisol are constantly being triggered, and these hormones don't create the best environment. Our Yorkshire Farms Amanda Owen breaks Instagram silence with Ravensy Family Update We want to facilitate the optimum chances for us to conceive, whether with IVF or naturally. However, she believes that juggling both her career and IVF treatment was almost impossible. She continued, I didn't do that. I was going off to Afghanistan and jabbing myself with IVF, drugs, and looking back now, I think, why? Why did I do that? But you can get caught up. Kate also spoke about the fertility troubles she faced as an older woman. The ex-BBC host added, We got married at 40 and then we had all the IVF and all the rest of it and, God, everyone that has been through IVF will know how much it messes up your body. Ex-Royal Marine husband Mike Heron and Kate eventually welcomed their first child after several unsuccessful rounds of treatment. The journalist gave birth to a daughter, Clemency Florence Rose, 12, in 2011. A few years ago, Kate left the news world to become a child counselor and support families struggling to conceive. Now 12 years later, Kate has taken to Instagram to share her journey with her 67, 600 followers. In a now-deleted collage and video, she reflected on how quickly Clemency had grown up, there's this lovely, delicious sense of her still being my baby. Don't miss! Daniela Westbrook slapped by doctor during nightmare ordeal, latest, Barry Manilow detailed leaving perfect wife after one year of marriage, latest, Graham Norton breaks silence after marrying filmmaker, reaction, she's still my gorgeous little girl, but equally, I'm delighted to see how she's maturing and developing. The mother of two continued, her confidence is just growing ahead of going to senior school, it's a lovely rite of passage for her to go through. Earlier this month, the Strictly star posted a sweet tribute on the now family of four and the journey to get there. She penned, I have spoken this week about our IVF journey and hoping to share what we learned along the way. Sick, one key message is to grieve your losses and keep your heart open, sending love. Author Rosie Nixon cheered her on, gorgeous Kate looks amazing, as do you. Another person added, what precious time with your beautiful family. The Essex-born star suffered two more miscarriages before giving birth to her son Wilbur at the age of 43. She told Hello, that she felt such utter joy in motherhood that I just wanted the chance to do it all over again. Despite my limited chances, I thought it was worth trying again. I just wanted to have one more try naturally and see what happened, 